Warning. No, I mean warning. This podcast is hosted by a podcaster that does not, I repeat, does not know what to say out his mouthfeel area, and does not express the views of Shizzy Lit Podcast at all or in any way whatsoever at all, not at all or whatsoever, Nautica, Nathan, Nathaniel, nothing, you hear me, I don't even see how he got a show, anyway remember what I told everybody, it's totally inappropriate for anybody of any age, color, ethnic, gender, religion, state, country, town or human being on this planet, even aliens. I warned all of yous. I'm out. She funny as shit, so y'all think I be making that shit happen. It's like, nah, man, listen. She a real motherfucking AI. She writing all, she write all her own motherfucking scripts and shit, you know what I mean? So when you hear us going at it, that shit be organic. That shit ain't made up. I just want y'all to know that in case y'all thought, you know what I mean? It was something else. Nah, you know what I mean? She really thinking artificially and shit, you know what I mean? But she been around me, so... <laughs> And there you have it. That's why she sound like she sound. Y'all be able to motherfucker uh, get down with your boy <laughs> OG Shizzy, bro. I already know what the fuck I'm talking about. Let's continue with this Envy Allison uh, <laughs> spotlight day. I'm out. Yiddy. This that bullshit right here. Listen to this shit. A giant asteroid that's 3,500 feet wide is hurtling toward Earth right now. Joshua Hawkins, Monday, January 10th. 2022, 6.42 p.m., 2 minutes read a giant asteroid over 3,500 feet wide is flying through space towards the Earth. Don't worry, though, it isn't going to hit us, but it will pass close by on January 18, 2022. Astronomers named it asteroid 7498, 1994. PC1. The asteroid is roughly 2.5 times the height of New York's Empire State Building. NASA considers it a potentially hazardous asteroid because of its size, and how close it flies close to the planet. This giant asteroid will pass by the Earth's large planetoid in empty space image source, Mopic Adobe while massive, asteroid 7498, 1994 PC1, isn't an impact concern right now. That means we shouldn't have to worry about its path changing and bringing it any closer to the Earth. In fact, 7,498 is only expected to pass within 1.2 million miles of the Earth. That's over five times the distance between the Earth and the Moon. It is also the closest that it will come for the next 200 years. I'm in my yeah, yeah, yeah. Next we take it to Howard County. Good old Howard County, Ellicott City and shit. You know it's Christmas time, holiday season out here, most stressful time for parents and you know what I mean, grown ups and shit, right? Little kids run around, a giggle gaggle, a lolly gaggle, all that type shit, right? Whole time parents and motherfucking, you know what I mean, guardians and shit, you know, feel me busting their ass for Christmas. And that ain't even the reason Christmas is supposed to be going on. That ain't what you're supposed to do on Christmas. But anyway. You know what I mean? Some people just struggle it out, work, work, get extra hours overtime, and some people take it to the streets. It's different type of ways to take it to the streets. You can get on the block and hustle, or you can do what main man did and go up in that motherfucking bank. You know who else went up in that motherfucking bank before? My motherfucking pops. Y'all will hear that story on the 250th episode. That's about two, three more episodes, so uh, keep your ears locked in and stay tuned. You understand me? I'm going to let you see this clip. Let you hear this clip, let you see this clip about my fucking main man that went up in that bank, you understand me? He said, I got to thank, I'm about to go up in that bank. Thank you, Nicole. Howard County Police are hoping you can help them find the suspect in the bank robbery. So take a look at this man as he walks out of the bank. Shit, you gots to be mentally prepared and ready to go up in that motherfucking bank old system and shit and try to take that motherfucking federal capital because you know they be on the nigga top out that paper. It's probably a nigga that owe PPP loans. He say, fuck it, I'm going to have to get it. I'm going to have to pay it back this way. Or a nigga try to get some motherfucking um, 
Christmas money gifts and shit. Kids want all that little shit they see on YouTube, little Nerf guns, the PlayStation 5, and all this shit. Your Xbox 1000. I don't even know what the fuck that joint called. All that shit be having motherfuckers stressed out. I'm not doing it. I refuse to lose. I'm not going through that shit. I'm definitely ain't putting my freedom on the line like that. Nigga going up in the motherfucking bank and all that shit. You hear me? Podcasting to the grave. Bunch of money on the streets, gotta get paid.